All right, let's do it. 358s, weed support. Gotta love it. Gotta love it. I always love weed support. It's always a fun track. It's harder to drive, harder to, it's, it's just harder to do everything. But that's what makes it fun. You gotta use a little bit of brake to get into one. A little bit of talent. Green, green, green. So run three and four. I mean, it's a good deal. I think that's the fastest two laps I have ever ran here. Hot damn diggity dog. That's what I'm talking about. I think the cars might be a little loud, but we got to use our ears to hear everybody. Oh man, wasn't fast enough. This is going to be, this might be a really good one, folks. These times, these times are close. <clears throat> and no heats, no heats. I got to remember that, no heats. <coughs> Excuse me. This is gonna be good. Man, I'm excited. I know it doesn't sound like it, but oh, did I just get pushed down even further? This is gonna be quite ridiculous if I'm in the back of the field because all of us are in the ones. I'm not, I'm not upset about it. That should be some really good racing. But sometimes, keep in mind, or bear in mind, if you will, people and drivers on the sim often qualify really well, but don't drive in a pack really well. In our, in our short journey, we've witnessed a lot of that, so... And something tells me the ones that didn't qualify are doing that on purpose for a reason. So everybody's in the ones except Mr. Langley. Mr. Langley puts out a 071. Good job to him. He is your quick time for this evening. But you'll be watching this in the morning with your coffee, hopefully. What kind of coffee y'all drink? Comment comment in the in the comment section. Let me know what kind of coffee you drink. I'm a death wish guy. Whole bean. Put it in the grinder. Brew it up. I don't like I don't like coffee that's already grounded. Very few. There is, I think, one one batch of coffee that I've enjoyed that was already ground up. And it's from an Alaska based coffee place. Uh I forget the name of it. But it is, I think it's a North Pole. I'll have to get the name of it. But if you ever want to talk about coffee in the comment section, let's talk about coffee. Comment down below. What is your favorite coffee to drink? Do you like to drink it in the morning or at night? If you're a night coffee drinker, I got some questions to ask you. And then I'm going to ask you why you're not on here racing me late at night. If you're a night coffee drinker. Because that's a real question. But anyway. Now that we're done filling that time. Let's go ahead and grid up. Line up on the inside. Get road closed. Alright. So. 
it might be a little loud. We're going to turn up some cars. Make sure we can hear the guys around us. Because there's no mirror. And there's no relatives, really, going on. So, I guess you got the lap times going. So, I guess that's kind of a relative, in a way. I don't know. But... That's all we got going. That's all we got going. We're going to get rolling here. These things are terrible to pace. So. And I don't. I, I just don't know why. I don't like pacing them. I'll race them all day. Not a fan of pacing them. Especially when everybody starts slowing down. These things get rickety. And more rickety. Feel like I can't hear the cars, which is driving me nuts. Oh, there we go. That might be the problem. One lap to green. Oh my! What? On my bad. Earth. My screen just went black for no reason right there. <laughs> That's Getting good. ready, going green. That's a good way to start. Now we got to bear in mind this first turn when he launches. Ooh, that's an early launch. Green, green, green. Car outside. Clear outside. Car outside. Clear. Car outside. Clear outside. Point nine, one, nine. Inside, clear. Car inside. Fifteen point four five nine. Clear inside. Car inside. Clear. Single file race at the moment. Fifteen point three nine three. Fifty 
One more lap to go. Keep going. Come on, man. <laughs> Come on, dude. Really? Car stopped up high. Car stopped up high. Car stopped ahead. I mean, you can be mad at me all you want there, but I've been on the brakes for you a few times this race in the turns. Great job, driver. So, respectively, man, I do apologize. Didn't mean for that to happen.
Good lord. Let's watch that back. Like, how many times? Like, no offense to the guy. But how many times are we going to have that mistake? That was a tough race. That last lap aside, that was a tough race. We'll see. We'll see if I could have done something differently there, but that's not the first time we've been on our brakes for that guy. It wasn't. Like it's not the first time he's made a mistake in that turn specifically. Like I get that you wanted to guard the bottom. But you guarded a little too hard. Like, you should have just ran a smooth turn. Yeah, we were running last place. Good stuff. Our fastest lap. Is that a little break going into the turn? Nope. No break. Just good grip. He could be mad. All he wants, I guess. Derek, I do apologize, but we're going to review. We're definitely going to review because that was not. It's also the same guy. We had a mishap in practice, which obviously the practice doesn't have this, but the, he made the same mistake. going into one where he cased the wall and he cases the wall again in here anyway that's what got us in that whole situation in the first place Whew. man that was close I sent her hard in there too boosted the throttle in was trying to set it yeah, I was trying to set it down right in here, but she just didn't. We did it in the slick instead of catching the grip the way we wanted to. We almost. Let's see if we can get. Let's see if we can get a good picture here. We almost. Send the 20 on a ride. Thank God we didn't. How close was that? I mean, that was... That was a close one. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Gyro cam that thing. Whew. There might have been a little contact, but, but I mean, no contact popped up. That was definitely my fault for pushing it that hard, but whew. glad we know where the brake pedal is. Glad we know. back to it overall I mean that was a really great race I I don't even care that I was in the back like which always I mean that will always happen at the start of a race I mean you will get shuffled back depending on what line you get and we had that little little scuffle in the front in the first lap we got bumped a little bit slowed us down so knew that was going to happen. Still a good race overall here in the back. I mean, we got we had some close racing there for a while. I almost almost made it happen here. Just did not have the traction. Oh, I did actually. I kind of had the traction there. Ooh, I straightened out just a little too much. Had to fall back in line. Make it up again. Ninety-two almost cases it in the wall.
Yeah, right there. So let's let's recap this, because this is what I'm talking about when I said that wasn't the first time. So, is Far Chase gonna do it? Hang on. Make some adjustments real quick. Let's go Far Chase. I like that. We can roll with that for now. All right. So, we're coming in. He, come, he cuts down too hard, trying to make that pass. Clips the wall. All right. On the brakes, we switch the brake. I thought he was sliding up further. We switch the brake. We get into him. On the brake, try to tap his nose back forward, which I'm pretty sure in the video, as we're filming, I said, no, go back straight. Literally tapping his nose to keep him in line. So there is the first example. All right. Now, we resume. Clips the wall a little bit there. So he knows I'm coming. He can see me right there. That's where he can see me. He's getting the wall bump on entry there. So, okay. So even, even better, right? Back here. This is where he sees me starting to make a move. Okay. Knowing I'm running the inside. All right. Goes high so he doesn't get wiped out. Because, you know, when you're on the outside going into one, you're going to have to. But right here decides to cut down to protect the inside. All right. So. Like, I get it. Defensive drive. But you got it like. You already know I'm right there. Like. Let's go ahead. Where's the nose at? Where's the nose cam? There it is. Like, I'm not far behind. He cranks her in. Now, if that was an adjustment, okay. So be it. He was getting ready to lose it a little bit. Decides to adjust. Okay. I can understand that. I won't even be mad at that. Right? Good correction on his part. He keeps, keeps the wheels under himself and goes. But in the process right and assuming he's not running a mirror i'm assuming but like you already know like you set the precedence back here man you are running the outside line you're up in the upper half of the back stretch so when you come down to protect that line like granted I get it. You're clear. But if you watch right here, I'm boosting it in and notice that he's doing that. So then I already have to stop. So the question is here. I don't even know if he clipped the wall. It looks like he clips the wall. He's definitely on the brakes. But did I touch him before that happens? Oh, rear chase. Let's back her up. Oh, nope. Hey, driver. How are you? All right, so. All right. So we'll watch it from this view. Back it up a little bit more. Bring the angle over just a bit. Sorry. Cameras are a new thing for me, so I'm learning. All right. So we're coming in. And it looks like...
we might have touched right there. Let's, I don't know. Let's switch the camera angle again. Okay, so is there going to be a possible net code here? No. He is already. He can be mad at me all he wants now. He is already pitched way too hard. Let's check. I am still not into him. Still not. All right. Still not. We don't make contact till right there. Granted, I probably could hit the brakes harder. Brake mods are not always a blessing. Because they definitely felt I was in the brake a little bit more than that. But it is what it is. I was not. So I'll admit that fault. I could have been on the brakes harder right there. But I can't. I can't do nothing about him already being cranked like like that's it's a bad that's a bad entry like you're gonna chop he didn't really chop my nose necessarily so I won't call that a chopping nose but he goes to protect the inside line which I can respect but if you're gonna do that like he's still like his wheels versus our wheels like. Our entry versus his, you know. We'll pop this down. We're angled a little bit. But he was, cr I mean, he cranked it going in and then stuffs himself. Like, there's not even a net code there. There's no contact until right there. So, hey man, I feel for you. I do. But, I mean, these things, I mean, you can't stop on a dime in that situation. It doesn't really matter who you are. And then we go on, and we finish the race. So, you can be mad. All he'd like. That's fine. But that's what happens. When you go into a turn like that, trying to protect the inside line, and you don't do it properly, you stuff the wall, man. And even if it doesn't show you stuffing the wall, in air quotes there, like, you still yacht out the car way more than you intended to. So, <sighs> well, we tried. We tried. Good race overall, though. Great race to everybody, including him. It was all great racing. Just had a few mistakes. But stay safe, kick ass, and we'll see you on the next one.